Hello, in this video tutorial, you will learn how to create a mandatory profile and what is the use of mandatory profile on Windows Server 2003 computers by tech.ptechrise.com Now let's see what is the use of mandatory profile. Well, to create a mandatory profile, first log on to a server with the administrative privileges. After logging, logging in the server, you have to first create a roaming profile and then convert the roaming profile into the mandatory profile. Go to start, administrative tools. Active Directory User and Computer. On the Active Directory User and Computer, click on the plus sign. Select the user folders and select the user in which you want to create a mandatory profile or you can create a new user. We will select a user. Sachin Sami. Right click on the user. Go to properties. Click on the profile tab. Type the profile path. Double slash. You have to put the computer name. If you don't know what is your computer name, you can also use the IP address but it is better to use a computer name to find out what is your computer name go to start right click on the my computer go to properties click on the computer name tab copy the computer name and paste the computer name then again slash after that you have to create a user share folder for a profile to create a share folder go to start open the my computer go to windows drive right click new folders type the any name which you want i am typing profile right click on the folder Go to sharing and securities. Click on the second radio button. Share this folder. Click on the permission tab. Give the change permission. Apply. OK. Then apply. OK. Now as you can see this folder is shared. Close this. And type the folder name. then again slash then put the username s f a y then apply ok after creating a user you have to log on from the client machine with the user id but first we will check the profile is created or not Go to the computer, C drive, profile folder. As you can see, there is no profile because profile is only created when a new user logs on first time on the computer. Now we will go to the client computer and log on it.
now type the username s f a m y put the password okay now for the roaming profile will be created for this user and after that we have to change that roaming profile into mandatory profile well after log on with the client id go to start my computer c drive profile folder right click on the profile folder properties security advance sorry click on the profile folder open the profile folder and as you can see the roaming profile folder is created right click on the roaming profile folder properties security add advance find now administrator okay okay give the full control to administrator apply okay then log off from the client and log in with the administrative privileges type administrator and the password enter go to my computer c drive profile folder user roaming profile folder you will see the file name nt user dot dat right click properties security sorry right click on the general tab delete the dat dot dat and type m a n man okay now your ro ro mandatory profile has been created to check that mandatory profile has has been created or not right click right click on my computer properties first you have to log on with the user privileges go to log of the administrator type the user password and enter with the user permission after logging on the user permi with the user permission go to start right click on the my computer go to properties on the advanced tab choose the second option user profiles click on the user profile and as you can see it is showing the mandatory type profile type mandatory and the status is mandatory that means the mandatory profile has been created thank you for watching this tutorial don't forget to watch our next tutorial that will be very informative